we are the Cunninghams. Uh, my name is Eric, and this is my wife, Jennifer. Uh, we have two children. Our daughter, Evie, is 12. Our son, Cade, is 10. And we have been attending the Avenue for 10 years. When we first attended the Avenue, we loved the music. Uh, we loved the, uh, the preaching. It was very welcoming. It was very warm. We felt, you know, like we were instantly part of the church. It was one of those things we got in the car, I think, that right after the first service and was like, this is the place we want to be. The two most spiritually defined moments is just when your children come to you and say that they uh, would like to have the conversation around a Christ um, being the center of their life. There's not a better feeling in the world and we've been able to experience that now with both of our children and there's so many people to thank uh, for that. Um, that, uh, that you know are, are huge parts of this church. Just being able to see your children grow in their relationship with Christ is probably like the best thing you could ever you know, yeah. witness. Our, our daughter uh, was baptized and as a parent there's not a better feeling in the world. Um, our son has made the decision uh, to ask Christ into his heart as well and he's going to be baptized on Life Day on August the 20th of this year so it's super exciting for us. As a couple and a family, we, we choose to give to the Avenue because it's, it's a blessing for us to be able to do so. We've been blessed in so many ways by this church, by God. So it's, it's very much a blessing. Um, it's a privilege to be able to do that. The church has given so much to us. It's just like, why wouldn't we sure. give back? You yeah. Know, why wouldn't we do that? It's just been incredible. It's, God's always blessed us. Like, I know that sounds kind of cliche, yeah. you know? The, the term is, is faith yeah. and, and it, there's just no other way to describe it. As we think about the vision of Accelerate, um, I, I think about the next generation. Our children, their friends, and, and um, everyone that comes into this church can see um, what's going on with our, our youth groups and um, the tremendous job that our youth ministers are doing. So that's my first thought is, is to you've got to think ahead to that next generation and, and, and the ability to um, find seats because this church is moving and growing and, and God's doing amazing things. And, um, for me personally, as an usher, we need some more seats, and uh, <laughs> that would certainly be helpful. I mean, I see it at family check-in, the amount of families that are first-timers. We've had a tremendous number over the last few months, and so I think that's only going to get bigger and bigger. God's definitely, um, he's pushing Jen and I, um, and you know, above and beyond our, our typical tithe. Um, and it, it again, I'm, it, it's, it's a bit scary. There's an expectation there for, um, for us to, uh, continue to bless. And that means above and beyond, uh, our typical tithe. And we've talked about it. We've prayed about it and we're prepared for that in uh, whatever way that may be. I think anybody that drives through Ellis County can see the growth that we're experiencing. So when I think about um, the Avenue specifically and that growth, I see huge things in store for this church. I just think the impact like on the youth, the families that are coming in, I know how it's the church has impacted us. And it's just exciting to know that all the things that we have gotten experienced in this church, that other families are going to get to have that same growth. Yeah. The, the, there, there's still uh, so much work to be done. You know, this, this church has a ton of momentum in this community, but we need to prepare for that growth. Um, and I, I see that happening. I really do. God's, God's got big plans for this community and the Avenue Church.